Okay. This is the uh, boysenberry pizza, which I believe you can only get at the Wagon Wheel Pizza. It's just past the exit to Ghost Rider. Straight over there. Um, you're going to have to go down that narrow path where it looks like there's nothing. And um, you can also get this on your meal plan, or does it just come with... This time they let me do it, but last time they went. Oh, okay. So <laughs> it depends on the person, apparently. Um, it's got like uh, arugula. There's um, like this is like a boysenberry drizzle. What is this? Yeah, that's like a boysenberry vinaigrette. And then there's like um, chicken, I believe, and then like uh, boysenberry sauce. And almonds. Oh, and almonds, yes. <laughs> the thing that's over the entire <laughs> top of the pizza, which I totally forgot. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's, it's, it's very, he it's a hefty pizza. Yeah. <laughs> If you're a person who only likes, like, really plain, normal pizza, this is probably not for you. If you like, like, a more, you know, kind of California pizza kitchen, like, out there kind of pizza, this is a good choice. Um, it doesn't come on the tasting card, but um, it's, it's like a full meal. So, this is like, um, cheese of some sort, actually. Always a very flavored cheese. Yeah. It, it kind of also doubles as the purple. sauce. <laughs> it's, it's all purple, so I can't tell you what it is. Um, but this is really good, um, but it's not like a normal pizza, <laughs> if you see what I'm saying. Like, this is, this is like, if you put this in your mouth and you're expecting like, like, like a piece of like Costco pizza, this is gonna like blow your mind because it doesn't taste anything like that. But, you know, it tastes a lot like uh, the more gourmet pizza kind of things and if you're like really adventurous I think that this would be a good thing to try while you're here at the Poison Festival.